This is Enrique with Coyote Health. Today I'm gonna be talking about my beautiful Euro tail lights that we just installed on the 2016 Mustang GT about a month ago. I'm gonna give you guys a quick review. I'm gonna show you guys the capabilities. What can you do with these wheels? Wheels. <laughs> we got NSA bed on the house over there. About to make another video as well. I don't know if I showed you guys this before, but I already got a new batch and it's custom made. It says Coyote Health. These Euro tail lights look way better than the stock tail lights either you got the straight tail lights or the little curved ones like those you know these ones have like the little curve and then 15 through 17 have just like a straight line if you are gonna get the your tail lights for a black car like i did you better get them clear i mean you might be going for a different look so you want them smoked but for me black on clear is the way to go these are the clear your tail lights they have smoked taillights as well. I want to give a big shout out to S550 Euros for hooking it up for me so I can have this beautiful look for the Mustang. My words cannot express what I'm feeling right now. Look at that. Look at that. That's, that's crispy, bro. That's crispy. It's beautiful, man. They're on point. Mm, mm. Uh, something that I didn't know about the taillights is that you can get, you got like two choices. I got the, the one with the one mode. I could have got the ones with the five modes. But I know by a fact that I'm not going to be using all five modes. So I just went with the one mode. Because the five modes you can like change to amber, red lights. And some other crazy shit that I got to look into it. Um, the price for these were $400. They're not cheap but they're not expensive. So from my heart, thank you as a 50 euros for hooking it up. Because look at my car now. It looks it looks amazing thanks to you guys i appreciate it i'm gonna keep buying stuff from you guys because you guys sell some quality products oh yeah i want to give a shout out to s to banana boat shout out to banana boat caesar thank you bro for sending me to si 50 euros all right guys i uh moved the car around so you guys can get a better lighting from the sun so so you guys can see that they're uh, wider than they look because in some pictures you guys will find them to look a little bit darker than they actually are they are very uh, clear very white and they're very nice they're beautiful just look at those things mm. I like the waving inside there's like a little waving going on if you guys can see it it's sexy mm. when the light hits the right bed on black mm, it's beautiful I think these tail lights complement and complete the whole look of the rear of the Mustang. I still gotta get like a diffuser, maybe get a new back bumper because that one's kind of messed up. Some of you guys might know, I'm not gonna say it, but I need some little shit underneath the rear balance to be able to fit the quad tips. So yeah, I gotta change that for sure from the back. It looks perfect right now. I don't think I'm gonna do nothing else to it. It just looks beautiful, it looks good. But most of the Mustangs, they got the wicker bill of the GT500, like the one that has like fucking three fucking poles, what stakes, whatever the fuck they're called. I haven't seen yet a Mustang in person with the same wing that I have. I'm not saying I'm unique. I don't want to say I'm the only one that I haven't seen that wing on Mustangs like in person. But that's pretty much it. I don't think I'm going to do nothing else to it. It looks perfect with the taillights, the Corsa quad tips and the APR performance wing. So for now, that's all I'm going to do to it. It looks, it just looks beautiful. Like I'm looking at it right now, I'm just like, God damn, let me show you guys. It just, just look at that thing. I don't want to say it's the best looking Mustang, but it's right there, man. It's, it's right there. Ahí la lleva, ahí la lleva. Se mira pasado de ver su chingada madre. When I was looking to buy the taillights, God damn it. I was uh, asking people that already had the taillights about the difference between the 5 mod and the 1 mod and most of them didn't know when you like have the lights on it looks fucking amazing even on red man the red looks fucking on point so it's like it's like a different kind of red it's not like a regular red I hope it's illegal but yeah it's fucking oh well, you can see the little the little more red when you're braking and shit it took me a long time to make up my mind to buy these these uh, lights. I wanted to get them a long time ago, bro, but I I said no, you know, I wanted to save some money. Tell me what you guys think about these taillights. 
you guys think the factory ones look way better or the euros clear for me is the best way to go uh some people like smoke yeah tell me what you guys think in my opinion they look amazing on a black mustang and that's the way it's gonna stay because that's the way i love it it's dying <laughs> the sun is dying um because it gets dark <laughs> Because it gets dark so fucking quick here in Cali. Like it's it's like 410 and it's dark as hell already. Well, this is it for this video, fellas. To be honest, I couldn't be more happy with how this taillight setup came out. And if you ask me, they are the cleanest, sickest taillights in the Mustang game. And I think you should get them too for your S550. They are totally worth it, guys. And I mean, either you go with the clear ones or the smoke ones. That's all up to you. And well... Thanks again, guys, till the next episode. Stay sexy, stay swift, and don't be a bitch.